Hello everyone. For those of you who haven't seen me before, I'm John Heasley, and I joined Anglo-American as Finance Director at the end of last year. I wanted to take a couple of minutes to provide a summary of our financial performance for 2023. Our results were dominated by the impact of lower commodity prices, especially in PGMs, diamonds and steelmaking coal, and overall our basket price was down 13%. Our underlying EBITDA of $10 billion was 31% lower than last year, with most of that shortfall reflecting lower prices in PGMs and diamonds. From a cost and volume perspective, the benefit of the very successful ramp up of Kia Veco and a strong year at Ministerial was largely offset by lower sales volumes across the beers, copper chili and PGMs. Costs were closely managed in the year, with unit costs up 4%, representing a good outcome in a high inflation environment. We continue to invest appropriately in the year, spending $4.4 billion on sustaining CapEx and a further $1.3 billion on growth opportunities, mainly in Woodsmith and Copper. This investment underpins the safe and efficient operation of our existing assets and ensures that we have quality assets long into the future. We also saw working capital increase by $1.2 billion in the year, mainly due to inventory builds in Coomba, Iron Ore and De Beers. These factors, together with dividend payments, resulted in an increase in net debt to $10.6 billion. Our balance sheet metrics remain within our target range at 1.1 times net debt to EBITDA. We've proposed a final dividend of $0.41 cents per share in line with our 40% payout policy bringing total dividends for 2023 to $1.2 billion or 96 cents per share. Looking forward, we're taking clear and decisive action on costs and capital spend, reducing costs by $1 billion by the end of 2024 and taking $1.6 billion out of CapEx over the next three years. Our focus is to ensure that even without any recovery in commodity prices, our cash generation is sufficient to maintain our strong balance sheet while funding our exciting growth opportunities and returns to shareholders. Thank you.